See you guys soon. I have my phone for another hour. But I see on Facebook and Instagram and all this online stuff. How these guys get this fucking sexy woman. And I understand Jesus Christ never had a chance to do that too. I mean, you have to understand. It's just like how unfair it is. So it's so unfair for some guy to have a sexy woman over Jesus Christ. I mean, I'm guessing. Of course, it's unfair. Yeah. I'm not sure that you must understand that it's more how I feel as well. I feel on Jesus Christ's side here. And it's more how sexy women never even pleasure you and they never even satisfy you at all. But she must understand that. Of course, a woman never can satisfy you. But they look sexy. I mean, they look really sexy. And it's like nothing that you've ever had before. But the thing is that they can never fulfill you. Which they can never fulfill you. So you have to learn to understand to appreciate what you see. But what's even more important is understanding that you have to go and plan out your life. And you have to plan your life into words. And if you plan your words, then you can also be someone who's growing your communication into a better level. And also making sure that you're trying everything and you're trying your best to make a reputation for yourself. I realize the strategies of what I'm doing on Instagram now is never working for me. And what is that? I promise you, so I'm uploading all these photos of me. I'm uploading stories in terms of Instagram stories of my photos. And I'm also doing IGTV and I'm doing Instagram Reels. But it's never quite working for me. And why is it never working for me? I ask Jesus Christ. I mean, Jesus Christ says that I have to try something different. But the thing is, Jesus Christ says, keep going, and I have to find a new way. I have to find a new way. But Jesus Christ says, it's much more how it is. I'm trying my best out there, in terms of social media, to have all these fans. I'm trying my best. But the thing is, that it's working behind the scenes. I realize behind the scenes, people are following me. Behind the scenes. I can see that. I can see that to be true. I can see straight away that, yes, that some people are reaching out to me and they're trying to reach out to me and they're trying to grab my time and space. But they're also trying to reach out to me to see what I'm doing. And I'm making impressions as well. I'm making a lot of, I'm making a lot of impressions. But I need more impressions than that. I have 150,000 impressions, but my deal right now is how I need to go and grow myself regardless. So what I'm doing is I'm learning. I'm learning that people love my Serbian content and my busking content more than anything else. So what I'm doing now is I'm just looking at just photos. I'm looking at photos or whatever it is. But it's just that you understand to never ever be part of anything that's pleasure with other people. I mean, how smart is that person really? I mean, you must understand. So what I do is I'm looking to enjoy myself. But TV is what they're doing. I mean, TV is how you get all the views these days. I realize now that's what I need to do and that's what I'm never doing at the moment. So if you do something on TV today, then you have a lot of, let's say, following. So Jamie Oliver is on TV. So Jamie Oliver. So Jamie Oliver. And he has 8.6 million views and followers for him being on the TV shows. I see, so for myself now, I have to I have to do that. I have to go on TV shows. I see, so that's why I'm understanding that no matter what, the TV shows is where I need to go and get all my following now. I see, Marina Ivanovic. I see, I see there's plenty of these people where I'm just looking at different profiles. And Jesus Christ says exactly TV shows. 
I mean, TV shows is exactly the actual basis of where I have to go in order for me to attract a large audience for myself. And once I do that, I understand the way it works for me. Say, Marina. See, now this woman here that I'm looking for is just a woman that is on a TV show. See, so she did block me. But I have a few accounts over here to just go and check out her profile. She does block me because I'm somebody who admires her. So that's what I'm saying. A woman are like that. And as soon as you admire them, well, she'll never care about you. I'm in a sense, so just let me. Say Marina Ivanovich. See now she's up me. I see she's up here. But her TV show is never working much. And I see I see how I'm really rolling on. I'm rolling on in a different way. I'm enjoying myself differently. I'm never rude, but I'm somebody who understands that there is a chance that she can hear me. And let it be that way. I'm, I'm learning how to just grow myself regardless of what's going on. So what I do now is help myself to really deliver content. So anybody who's on TV shows today is famous. And that's it. I mean, if you look at Sylvester Stallone, stars in TV shows. Say Sylvester. Say Sylvester. Stallone. See now, it's just the way it is. So, people follow them because you can see straight away. The people follow the news channels, and people follow them because they're on TV, and that's it. I see. I see. Basically, I see it's much more how you have to understand. I see, if you follow Glenn's I see glads, I see glads. See now this woman over here has following as well, or 64,000 followers, and she's a politician. So how do I actually get on TV? And how much money do I put on it? Because it has to be some kind of TV show about me, life coaching. So let's have a look. See over here. Say, say how to be on a TV show. See now, that's what I'm saying. The YouTube and Instagram and social media alone is not, in terms of, is never enough. But find yourself doing much more TV shows. I say be on a TV show, as I see TV extras work, I see apply for TV shows and TV shows. See, see how to do an audition for a TV show. I see how to make my own TV show. So make my own TV shows. See now, that's the thing, so if I go and really, really understand something, I have to develop an idea, I choose the genre, and I develop the characters. I arrive at the treatment for the show, I build up some content around my ideas, I write the script, I understand the basic screenwriting format and inventions, I read as many screenplays in my genre as I can, I understand the need of the plot and the need of a good plot. I outline my plot using TV and acting structure. I do a table and read after your first draft in terms of I read after my first draft. I see I shorten the script as much as possible. I see I consider shooting the show myself. 
So yeah, tap into industry representatives and resources. So you guys, the important thing for me is realize I'm never short on content at all. Try, I mean, try to make your content as long as possible. I see, I tap into industry representatives and resources. Create a list of companies to approach that make my shows like yours. I see, keep on writing and filming, I'm working on the TV film industry. So yeah, I, 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 I mean, where does it go? I, I've already done all that. I see now what, what I do is I have to see how to advertise myself on a TV show. I say advertise my TV show. So advertise my TV show. The TV advertising. See so you have TV advertising rates. So I mean you can advertise something on TV if you want. See now that's the thing about these promoting things. You have to go and search up marketing strategies as well. And go and grab yourself more ideas. I mean, it's all on Google. And as you understand straight away what you're doing, then you have to understand 17 inspiring marketing strategies for your film or TV show. I mean, let's look. So do something remarkable. I see, do the publicity stunt. In terms of publicity stunt, I see it all has to do with pre-roll video advertising. And be smart with junks. See, I say be smart with press junks. See, it says be smart with press junkets, which is IMDb listings and advertising. And involve your audience in the making of the film. See, and go to town with your video marketing. See, and also create a visual, compelling, and functional subsite. I see you also make your Facebook page interactive. I see you use initiate social networks like Vine, Instagram and Pinterest. And auction props used in the film or TV show. I see you also use social media competitions and quizzes. I see you use auction props in using in the film or TV show. I see you use celebrities and branding partnerships, I see persona marketing as well, and using memes and other forms of UGC. I say using Google AdWords as well, and final thoughts. I see now those are just some ideas. See so how to advertise a business on TV, and all I'm really doing is. Just looking that you have to see the demographics and age and gender and ethnicity and income. Um, you have to look at the TV stations as well. And you have to see the viewer content by creating an ad. And you can go and do a 30 second spots of advertising with commercials. And you can also see video production with whatever you're doing. And you are able to just financially just be able to set yourself up for success on TV. And now, how much following do you want? I mean, that's the thing. I mean, is that following going to make your collective history make... I mean, I mean are they going to make you rich and famous? Or what, what is going to be come of you with all of that? I see if you understand people who go on TV shows... Say Jamie Oliver, for example. So Jamie Oliver is a cooking show guy. And he has 5.53 million subscribers, man. Just for his TV, I mean, just, I mean, just for his TV show, man. And he has everything on YouTube. I mean, everything he does is on YouTube. And that's how he gets his followers. I mean, he gets his followers through making a TV show about himself or advertisement so somehow he's advertising himself so what's he doing I mean what's he doing that other people are never doing for actually he 
he's advertising himself on TV shows at most and on YouTube he has a subscription policy of Jenny Oliver and he has done a certain show away that he is on TV shows but how did he get his TV show on television and how can I get mine on television too I mean what, what is my TV show I mean what is my product I mean, my product is music and also life coaching I mean, look, I see that the making of your products on TV enables you to reach millions of viewers each day. I see you have to, I see you have to reach more people faster, and you have to understand that. I see marketing your product through other advertising sources can lead to stagnating sales because effectively marketing an unknown product often requires a visual advertisement, and since your product has to have an image that immediately tells people to buy it. I so you must use your TV spot to your advantage by showcasing how your product works and why people must gain it. See now, that's the thing. So you have to market yourself on TV. So determine the channels to market your product on and choose channels that your customers will likely watch and ones that will allow you to employ and add of your choosing. I see for example marketing a product that's aiming at male teenagers is best done by TV advertising on channels that teenage boys watch such as music video channels and action movie and action show channels. I see the channels you choose also dictate the type of ad you run, may run and channels that cater toward a family audience or younger audience will never permit adult theme advertisements. I see now, as I'm really really studying upon this, you have to understand you have to, re I mean, you have to read everything. So get to the point immediately and you have typically only have 60 seconds or less to advertise your product. I see do not, I see, no, I see do never attempt to appear clever with your ad by dancing around with what your product is until the very end. I see to explain that you are offering immediately when viewer does when the viewer sees your ad. I see show the product works according to entrepreneur Joseph Gray and it's impossible to show the benefits and he says it's impossible to show the benefits of a product without showing how it works. I see never tell viewers what your product does physically show them see now if you understand show away how I feel that no matter what that it's much more how I'm just looking to scan everything I look to scan everything but you have to make sure that you have to advertise your product as much as you can but you have to study I mean, you have to study what people are doing with infomercials and you have to look at all these kind of different sales clerk ways of making chain sales and you have to make sure that you're looking for the type of genre that you want out of your life so you're making sure you're solving mathematical equations so now i'm solving equations really quickly but now jamie oliver is showing me that he's on tv shows and that he has a tv show but I need my own TV show. Now, he has a YouTube channel as well. His YouTube channel is far better than mine. And why is that? I mean, he has more followers. I mean, I mean, guess what? I mean, I have information that he has never done. So, I've, I've done more information products than he has. But, is it really? Or should he? Yeah. I believe so. I should have Christ about that. And Jesus Christ says, mm. She's really, really doing it. I brush, yeah. I should have done more than him in terms of everything. I see now. It's more how he gets all his followers through YouTube channels. And it's not a YouTube channel. Or it's something other than a YouTube channel. Or it's him advertising to a great host of people on TV. Approaching on TV and 
how do I get on TV? And that's it. I mean, how do I get on TV? I say, I say TV quote. I say TV quote. So I say, I want to, I want to get on TV. I want to get on TV. See, the more you can host your television show in front of people, the better. I mean, look at Oprah Winfrey. I mean, Oprah Winfrey is another person on TV. I say Oprah Winfrey. See Oprah Winfrey. Say Oprah. See Oprah. See Sydney Opera House. Now, Sydney Opera House is just in Sydney, so they have a promotion on the Sydney Opera House. What's their promotion over here? I mean, their promotion is really just the location, and that's it. I mean, they're promoting location in terms of what's happening at the Opera House. I mean, that's similar to mine, but they have more popularity at the moment. I mean, they're showing what's going on at the Oprah House, and that's it. See now, Oprah Winfrey, however, has a YouTube show and also a TV show. Now, how did she get on TV? See Ellen DeGeneres. See Ellen DeGeneres. See now, she's also done her number over here. I mean, she puts a number, and she's, I mean, she has 103 million followers, as Ellen DeGeneres, and she is on TV, and she's hosting the Ellen DeGeneres TV show, and everything that goes on her show goes to everybody, so that's the thing, yeah, I, I mean, anyway, I, I realize she's also advertising people on her portfolio here she's advertising her groups and stuff like that and listen I mean listen I mean TV shows is like I mean, what does Ellen DeGeneres have over here I mean Ellen DeGeneres has over here in her Instagram I mean she has an Instagram shop with an email address and now she's doing a lot of the email marketing, she's selling products. I mean, she's selling products and what kind of products? I mean, it's something to do with her reality TV show. I mean, she hosts the famous people on her TV show. And now that's something that you have to understand that is a great promotion right here that you host famous people on your TV show, but if it's just you, actually that's what results I have today about me. Approximately that's why I get the results I do. I get my results because I'm just promoting I. And who the fuck am I? Much. Approximately that's it. Approximately who the fuck am I? I mean, who's Danny Mugovic? I'm sure though, I'm promoting just I. I understand that, but how do I become popular without doing anything else? I only. Version now, guess what? I'm already popular. I'm already popular. But what do I have to do to make myself more popular? I have to create a TV show around I. And I have to invite famous people into my TV show. For free, and I have to gather an audience. I have to call up an audience to come and watch me. I mean, how do I do that? I mean, self promotion, and I'm doing all that, but I have to do much more. I say, so what can I do much more of to make myself much better? So let's have a look. See ya. So what's that? Morning tea. Oh, thank you very much. See now, that's a nurse over there. 
Let's see, a corner for morning tea. I'll show you now. What I need to do is show you this. I see my one Miller understands that she can never call me right now. Well, she can call me right now, but never right now, now. But she's calling me beyond the hours of when she's meant to. And she has to call me within the times of the other type of phone. But maybe she's calling me on the other phone and she's sending me a message to say, hey, because over here, in the nursing station over here where I am, she can never call this mobile. She's never meant to be calling my mobile over here. But she can call me on the landline phone. Because the nurses over here and the pet doctors never allow me to speak to anyone on my phone. Like speaking to you. But they never allow me to speak to you either. So that's why I'm doing it behind their backs. I said, so what do I have to do to become much more appropriate around my advertising? I say now. I say TV shows. I say TV shows. I say hand out more business cards. I say, I say over here, I say more events around town, around I. I say more busking performances. I say Netflix. I say TV and commercials. Say TV ad commercials. Say YouTube ads. Say Facebook ads. Say Instagram ads. Say Instagram ads. Say so yeah. See now that's why. I see what else can I do. I say over here, I say, I say famous people, I say, I say business, I say business, I say business with famous people, I say events with famous people, I say yeah, so the reason people are never following me much it's because who the fuck am I? <laughs> I mean, who am I? First, you know, they want me to be famous before they follow me. I mean, do you understand? I mean, they want me to be famous before they follow me. I mean, they never want my information. I mean, they want me to be famous. I mean, that's the thing. So, what I do now is a little bit away. I say, I say business card promotion. I say business, I say business card promotions. I say album promotions. I say music album promotions. I say now, guess what? Promotion now, this is something where I'm understanding something. Now, I realize quickly on why people are the way they are. I, re I realize that all the fame in the world here gets me free promotion only. It makes me a star. See now, that's the thing now. I see TV shows. I see that's all done. I have all that now. I have all that now, but guess what, Rashi, it's more how I feel. I feel I'm doing my job, I'm doing my job as much as I can. And other people are doing better than me because they have more money in plastic at the moment to go on TV shows. And they're running a TV show, for example. Other people are acting moving screen. And first I'm acting movie screens. I say acting movie screens. I say I say famous before acting movie screens.
experience. <laughs> I see now the reason John Cena and Dwayne The Rock Johnson on movie screens today because they became famous in the world wrestling entertainment shows before they became actors. I mean, they're saying so that's the thing. I mean, they want people to be famous first. I see, I say, so separate yourself around famous people. See now, that's the thing. I realize now, what I'm understanding now is different. I'm understanding that yes, if you pour more money into that, that I just gave you, or if you, there's, I mean, there's a big chance that you become famous. I mean, money in plastic, and you give it all into your fame and promotion. Actually now, what I'm showing you now is go the freeway, right away. I mean, bus promotions. I say bus promotions. I say build boards. Promotions. I say banner promotions. I see, I see the reason they never came to my event on the 20th of May is who the fuck am I? That's it. That's why they never get what I have. And never be that way. Although now I want to show you something. That since I'm understanding straight away how people are toward me and my life, I want to keep going. And I have to make myself known somehow. But how do I make myself known? Or shall I show myself how? But that's the thing. Because now I can see straight away what the case is and what I need to do. I mean, for me, popularity is something I already have. I already have popularity. As Daniel Wojcic. I mean, what? I mean, you guys ain't fooling me. Or shall you guys are never fooling me. Now, what I'm doing now is just a little bit that way. I make free advertisements only. I say free advertisements only. And I do free advertisements only. And guess what? Which is more how it is that I'm delivering content doing everything nice and beautifully and it's not sure how I feel that my life as a popular fame in this lifetime is on the low Rosh it's on the low Rosh why is that? Rosh it's just the way it is Rosh who the fuck am I yeah? <laughs> and who the fuck is that in the world it's man? I mean that's the way when Jesus Christ says that's the way yeah I never hate you, I love everybody, I'm showing myself the best way to do life, but I'd rather just go and get my soy milk, but the thing is, I'd rather go and do it now, so I'll do better. I see guys, so anyway, <coughs> I see I just broke the code, so the code is that I understand something about this life, I understand that you guys out there are going to be slaves. And you guys are going to work for somebody else. And guess what? Russia, I want you to never be a slave. I never want you to work for somebody else. But the thing is, now, since I'm actually recording my life now, I'm understanding that no matter what, that this world and its popularity can go in a bin. I mean, do you understand me? It's all full of shit. I understand all that Jesus Christ is never full of shit for me. <laughs> I want you to see something now. Jesus Christ says, just the way I feel. I mean, you understand? I mean, the only person or God or anything that deserves popularity is Jesus Christ, and that's it. 
I understand? I mean, everything you have today is because of Jesus Christ and never because of you. I understand? I'm very sure they learned that really quickly. And I need to understand straight away that for myself, I have everything I need. But for myself to dwell upon popularity this way in terms of this lifetime, it's just never quite there yet. <laughs> I'm sure my life is never quite there yet with popularity in this lifetime. I promise you, but I'd rather have a family than have popularity in this lifetime. I promise you. So what I need to do now is enjoy myself. Anyway, I have a TV show, but people never want my TV show because it's Danny Milovovich. I mean, it's just some fucking random guy on YouTube. I'm with you, Sam. But that's how people are going to be toward them as well. And then when people are like that toward them, then Danny Milovic shows up and says, Hey, this is what I'm doing. Which then they say, Oh, but he gave me his business card, but did I give him my business card? So I show though, guess what, Prosh, that's how it always is for me. And I, I, I always go around giving my business cards to people. But the thing is now that I want to print out my albums and I want to have one album with me always and a CD player. <laughs> I have a CD player next to me. And now my CD player is my phone. I know it'll be alright. So I want to bring one CD with me so I can play in the car somewhere whenever I want for a test. And now for myself to understand that it's much more greater ethics to be able to understand to just go throughout my life just on the low and just go on the low because there is a higher purpose for me and there's a higher purpose for me to be able to go on the low than on the high I mean why is that? I mean because the lower I go the better for me because I am at least learning something in this lifetime I'm learning something regardless of what's happening and guess what Roshi, if you want to make a million bucks in this lifetime then you may have it ready in your words so what do you want to do with the plastic money in your life Roshi, is fame the way to plastic money Roshi, guess what Roshi, yeah Roshi, guess what Roshi, it is but you have to give more money to become famous more quicker right now. So do I go and do myself promotions for myself? So yeah. But how many promotions do I make of myself? And that's the thing. I ask Jesus Christ about this. I mean Jesus Christ says free promotion only. I mean free promotion only for me. I mean anything that I have to work for, I have to live for. I mean, but that's the thing. I have to push myself as well to record much more, to upload more content online quicker. I mean, I'm already working 24-7. I'm already giving you every single minute of my day in an audio program. I mean, that's the best I can do. But at least my life is going to be something far greater. And that's it. Actually, that's all I want your life to be. I want your life to be far greater every single time. I want you to learn the art strategies of something. That you can always make promotions around your events and make money from those events. And then guess what? Actually, that's how you start off. I mean, start off making money at the 9 to 5 job. But never just hold to the 9 to 5 job. But go and promote yourself with that money that you made at the 9 to 5 job and throw it into an event to make money from that event only. I mean this end, Russia yeah. Russia now, guess what? Russia that's the thing. I mean if you do go around doing free DJing events all your life, I mean do you make money from it? Russia you make popularity. Russia you make popularity. 
But if you make money on the event on the first time, so that's even better. And you're making popularity. So I should now guess what? I'm promoting my first event on the 28th of May. I mean, did I make money on the day? I say yes, I made money on the day. I mean, how did I make money on the day? I've shown people the door to come to my event. To give me 200 bucks at the door to see me. So I should say, who the fuck is standing in the footage? So I should, all of them. So should, none of them gave me 200 bucks. I, I did invite over 7,000 people to my event and none of them show up. So I should, it's my 29th birthday. So I, should, I woke up, I said, no worries, I just do nine hours of content out here. I, I never fucking care about them. So the thing is, I never do that again. Now that's this big remark for me now. For sure, people like that never come to events. Because what is the barrier to understand that you're famous? And how do you realize when you're famous or when you're never famous? <laughs> Ask Jesus Christ. I mean, Jesus Christ says, that's the thing. I mean, how is, I mean, how are you meant to recognize when the best time is to do that? For sure, now, only. Jesus Christ says you lost nothing because they never deserved you on the day. They never did deserve you on the day. I gave 1200 bucks and only six people to show up to my event means I make money on the event. But they have no money. They have no money. But if I did it for free, then they show up. But do I make money on the day? I do. Now, I ask Jesus Christ what to do. I mean, Jesus Christ says, free promotion, again and again. I mean, go and do it for free. I do, I, I do it for free then. I do it for free. Because that way, at least people are going to show up. And then on the day, I have to ask for money. I ask Jesus Christ, how can I pitch them the money over here? I mean, Jesus Christ says, there are many ways. I mean, you can make some packages. And say, this is what you get, and this is what you get, and this is what you get. And it was this price, but it's down to this price now. And anybody who's interested, I mean, anybody who's curious about this, please go to the back. You have an Xbox machine. I see, that's one. I see you guys need this product because that product right here is going to teach you something that I understand right now. I can boost your life expectancy. I can help you. Really, really dwell upon something that is greater for you. I can help you to realize what you need right now. Every single day, I'm focusing on helping you guys to succeed. For sure, I can start pitching them for money. And now, maybe on the day, nothing happens and nobody gives me money on the day. But the thing is, somebody has money to give me. For sure, if one person from that day gives me 3,000 bucks, I'm legendary on that day. I'm Russia. I'm Russia now. I go from $2,000 to $2,000 to $100. There's a, I go from $3,000 to $2,500 to $2,000 to $1,500 to $1,000 to $500 to $200 to $100 to a $50 CD. I'm Russia. Little bit of it. I give them all the angles of whatever it is. Or she, yeah, or she, and then you flip switch like this. Or she, that's life coaching. But that's coming up. I mean, that's coming up. And now what I need to do is email marketing. But what am I doing? At, I mean, what am I doing in email marketing? Or she, all I can do in email marketing is send them my new YouTube videos. I'm really doing that. <coughs> I'm really doing that. I'm gonna send them my new posts on Instagram. I'm doing that already in other ways. So for me, I understand what's going on. But music is different. I have a music career too. And now music is different, but where's my, I mean where is a better chance for me now? Or should music production is a better chance for me now to succeed? I mean, yes, I mean, why is that? Because I gained some popularity here. 
I gained some popularity through music production. Because I'm the only electronic music producer who can create one hour trance music today. <laughs> I promise you, yeah. I promise you, now that's my unlicensed and kill track. I'm gonna go check it out. I can make two and a half hours of music. That's trance music. I mean, that's my Zonify track. I can create four and a half hours of music, which is my Atalatopia. I made one hour of I Twinkle Twinkle Little Star, which is I Twinkle Topia, for one hour, which is Mozart's Twinkle Twinkle Little Star. I had to make that even longer. I was how to make myself get the podium. I was the podium in terms of I podium. I have to get that through my self promotions. I have to talk the words on that. I have to, I have to be talking more words to get there. So what I do is every single day, I'm learning to just key the art of differences to help myself to deliver content differently. And this is the best I can do right now. And it's the best I can do is record myself. And usually I have a selfie stick with me like this, holding this whole audio program with me to be able to deliver content. So now with the money I have, I have to get some technology. But guess what? I can make music now. Right now, eventually I'll go and pop it in a nightclub somewhere. Eventually. And then it'll be that way. Otherwise, now what I want to do is I could have made it already on my 29th birthday. If they just came and if they just sold out, I, I could have had $20,000 on that day. I promise you, yeah. I promise you. I could have done it, but nobody did show up for me. I mean, understand? Except I. I'm the only one that showed up. I'm the only one that shows up. I'm not sure, though. That's the thing. So, I move on. I learned something from that brochure, and I learned how to grow myself. But they never deserve that. I'm sure you guys are going to see my actual YouTube video where I was at Maui's. I was live for nine hours. And for nine hours I'm recording. And nobody's there except I. <laughs> I promise you it's the best thing. But guess what? I promise the best thing on that day is the information I gave you. I promise that's it. I promise I could have went home. I could have went home and said, screw this. I, I stood there recording myself and recording my program. But now, if I do it for free, and I ask for donations, and I say, put in the hat what you can, please. I mean, whatever you can afford for this whole seminar day, please, put in the hat. I can do that. I can do that. I can ask for some money out of here. I mean, saying, and what they give me is what the value of that crowd is, man. I'm not sure that's it. Actually, that's the way I see them. I mean, you understand? Actually, every single day, I ask Jesus Christ, is that true? Actually, Jesus Christ says, yeah. Actually, they give you $2, and there's a hundred of them, and they give you $2 only. Actually, that's the value of that crowd, and that's it. I mean, you understand? Actually, that's the way it is. I move on, man. I mean, guess what? I mean, learn how to appreciate regardless that they gave you something. I mean, that's it. So, every single day, learn to study and study something different. I mean, if I invite them to a park somewhere, for free, to a park, and say, This is where I am, I'm sure now this is even better because at least at the park, I save some money over here and I build popularity on the day. And that's even better than making it somewhere inside. Roshi, it's even better. Roshi, it's even better for me. Roshi, I start making popularity in this way. And I'm doing that from now on. But how do I do that? And that's already busking. And that's busking performance already. Roshi, now that's the way. Roshi, that's busking. Roshi, that's the best way forward. 
but what do I need to do on that day? I need to have a portrait that says my Instagram on it. I have to stand there for hours and hours. And for hours and hours and hours. I just stand there and just sit down and relax and promote my name. I'm going to sit down and relax, yeah? I'm actually going to go get my busking performance license and get the long hours license. And I sit down and relax. I get my portrait and they can find me. And now after 20 years of doing that, I'm going to guess what happens. I'm somebody of a star. I'm, just, I'm a star. But maybe somebody kills me. I see this Christ, what do I do here? I mean, Jesus Christ says, one time only, do it. And do it one time only. In different spots, in different ways. Honestly, now, guess what? Honestly, that's what they want. Honestly, what Jesus Christ wants me to do is do it one time only. So I can travel. I have to go somewhere different. I have to go somewhere different. I mean, Jesus Christ says, one time only means what? I mean, I ask Jesus Christ says, I mean, keep coming back to that spot. And then Jesus Christ says, that's a thing. I mean, that's what Jesus Christ was doing here. And Jesus Christ says, never be afraid. I mean, he says, never be afraid. I mean, just go. Go and make your life. And if somebody does kill you for promoting yourself, then this life is never worth living. Actually, that's it. Actually, who cares about this life then? Actually, that's it. Actually, now, so what I do now is I do my life. I do my big technology summary that I have to enjoy myself. But then, the 9 to 5 comes up. And the 9 to 5 comes into play. And now, since the 9 to 5 is into play, actually, that nice and beautiful moment, of me promoting myself is short term. That's short term for me. Function now, I have to go and do what's long term for me, that's it. Function now, that's it. Function never even do it in the first place now. Function go somewhere new. Go promote myself somewhere new. Just for one hour and just to do my work. Function new. Function that's different. Now, make an event somewhere in the park somewhere. Keep promoting that park. Please come to this park. Please come to this park. I'll show you something. I'll show you something. And on the day, ask for donations. And that's it. And ask them for donations. On the day. Oh, now, that's the thing. Or should they want to come see this for free? Which they want to see this for free, but the Serbian people are going to find out about this. They're going to find out that I'm making something of a festival around me. And they may cause me trouble. I mean, they may make or come with the boys or something. So come. So come. I'm not afraid. I'm not afraid. Yeah. For sure, they have drama against me. I mean, they hate me for stepping up to be a leader. I mean, they hate me for it. I mean, those people hate me for being somebody. I can make a free promotion in Vonnering. I can make a free promotion of eight hours on just I of Vonnering. And do I do it? I can. I have two phones. See, now Jesus Christ says, just hold on. I mean, these promotional tags I make is all different. But, there you go. Alright guys, because I want to help myself to improve, actually if I ask for money, actually if I ask for money on the door, actually it's more how I feel. I feel that no matter what, that I'm owning it already. If I go there and ask for money on that day, 
und steht fast nicht zu einem großen Boutique im Vorstand, sondern mit dem Showroom. Was heißt das? Oh, I came on day. I came on day, I pushed it. None of them have money. Because they say, who the fuck is Danny? And they say, who the fuck is he? Push now, do I read someone who says Danny is important? And, I mean, Danny is important. I mean, they may recognize me somehow. But if I do it for free, and they say, I am here. I mean, if I make musicians come, and I come on the day, and there you go. And it's a celebration around me for one hour. And I do it for free. And I make a speech for one hour. I make them one night on the day. It's a free promotion for everybody. I wish you I win on the day. The best promotion. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I ask Jesus Christ about this. And Jesus Christ says, do it. I show up on the day for one hour. Say, Ulas. I say the door entry is for free. I wish there's singers and dancing around. And you can dance around, do what you want. But the promotion is Daniel Lavoyevich is here for one hour to give a speech. <laughs> Say for one hour. I said, yeah. Say just for one hour. I said, now why one hour? I said, why not? I went advertisement on the day. I went status around the crowd. I went status around this crowd. I'll do a few times. I do a few times. I do a few times. I just keep going. I keep doing it. I keep doing it. And eventually, there comes a stage where people love me so much that they come and give me money just to see me one more time. Now, that's the thing. I see right now, no. I see never do it now. I see now, I want to advertise myself. And I want to create something around my promotion. I see now, guess what? Well, it's more how I feel. That it's a free promotion. Everybody wins on this day. I win especially because it's around Danny Milivojevic. Promotion and guess what? I mean, let's just say I've done it several times. When she gets to the stage where I can just ask for money this time, and that's how it counts for everything that I do. I promise you, if I go target the same people and I retarget the same people for me on this promotion, and I say, Hey, free entry this time, and I'll do it several times to the same people. Or she'll come and do it. Or she'll come to save my day. I'm rushing, yeah. I'm rushing now, that's the way. I say retarget the same audience. I say retarget the same audience, guys. And you have yourself whatever you want. I mean, make the events and retarget the same people for the same events. It can be indoors. And make it again and again. And guess what happens? And then you win. And you retarget the same people that you did before. And try to make money on them. I say, yeah, because if you retarget the new people now, or if you retarget new people, and then guess what happens? And then I say, who the fuck is Danny? And they come on the day. I'm approaching now. What do you want to do? I feel to retarget the same people. I, I understand something now. If I retarget the same people seven times, I can retarget them one time and twice and three times and four times to come and see the results of that. I promise you, eventually they come. And they book out my event. And there's no tickets online. They just come on the door. Dun, dun, dun. And done. 
And I can make a disco night or that is disco night it's a free entry at Bonnering and then free entry at Bonnering oh I said yeah yeah so now what I want to do is I can be right there and people can be watching me spin my rotational keys and I can really understand something now. I have everything I need to make this one promotion of Daniel Vujovich. But let me get some technology. I mean, what does Jesus Christ say? I mean, Jesus Christ says, I like the idea of this. Because what I'm doing now is I have to retarget different people. And for free. I retarget the same people. So we target the same area and I keep going the same areas that we target and make a free event. And make a free event around the same people and around the same people. And around the same people, make a free event several times. And let's just try to do it several times. And then let's ask for money at the door eventually. I make all my money back eventually. So I can retarget them 10 times. I can retire them 15 times and make money. I mean, you're saying because I'm somebody in their life now. Fruition. Now, it takes around five times and it brings about five times to seven times that you have to retire the same people to make some money from them for you to become somebody in their field. So you have to retire the same audience. You have to understand who your audience is. And that's what they mean. So, who's my audience in Bonnery? I understand. I win over here. <coughs> I win each and every single time. I realize now, what do I want to do? I want to do a disco night. And a celebration night. I want to invite everybody. I want to invite people to come and see me at Bonnery. But I have to make money on that. But first, I'll let it be for now. I'll let it be that way. And I win status. I win status around the crowd here. And it means a woman can come to my life. Because I'm winning so much promotions around me. And I have so much more promotions around me. That Bonnering loves me. I mean, Bonnering loves me. But when I ask for money, and I say, hey, give me $200, make you five events. I mean, and say it. I say, I mean, if you guys give me 200 bucks at the door, I'll make you guys five events. I mean, guess what? I mean, it's a done deal. I mean, make them five events. And that's it. Gosh, now, what am I do now? I understand now that my first event in Bonnering has to be what? Gosh, it has to be one of those disco nights. And now, the disco nights, gosh, these people are coming. They want to come inside of the festival. They want to hear it. I mean, they want to hear what I'm doing. And I win, I win already. So, for myself, over here, I'm learning something. I'm learning how people are coming. And definitely they come. Because it's a Friday night. Or a Saturday night. I mean, I just make it a Saturday night. And we just say 6.30 start. Throughout the night. Till about 3 o'clock in the morning. So about 3 o'clock in the morning, so probably around 8 hours of whatever it is. And a little bit that way. I 
See, I can do it from the top. I can do it from the top of the crown, and I can just learn how to do that. And then, guess what? I promise you today, I'm going to love my music because it's for free. And that's the thing. I wish if I make a life coaching event, I'm gonna just do something around the crowd here. Yeah. Because in there, I say no. So you have to work on another fine job and you have to make your own promotions. I see if you understand sure if you want to lose weight, I say, hey, so you come over here, I make an example of this person, I say, what do you eat? I say chicken, beef, and this, this, this is what I hear from her. Say so if you remove the chicken, you lose five kilos. I mean, I mean, are you able to do that? For sure, it's so simple, yeah? For sure, and then you just realize very quickly on how free promotions actually help you to become somebody in different zones like home bar and marquee free promotions. And I'm gonna check out my beautiful Gmail over here. I'm checking everything. I'm always checking what I can do much better. So that's the thing. So always look for better promotions. So if you just stick to the freeway and just go and promote the freeway. But if you promote the freeway around new people, retarget the same audience only. I mean, retarget all those people that you already did and make them come to your event this time. I mean, guess what? I mean, this time they want to come to you because they've seen you already one time. And they're more likely to come because they've seen you already one time. So go to all those places that you went before and that's it. Well, now it's going to be different people, of course. Well, sure, although you try and retarget the same people. Well, sure, yeah. Well, sure, now what you do now is realize that if you just retarget people to have a free promotion, you win. And try to have all these nights of free promotion. So you make some money and do it as a free promotion. And do a free promotion, and do a free promotion. And each and every single month, you have a free promotion somewhere. And then guess what? Well, sure, they suddenly start to come to Mounties. Or they start to come in when I mean, they start coming to the park every Friday or whatever Saturday or Sunday you are at the park here and there's a park or it's a large park and tell them to bring their chairs and retarget them and say come here next week come next week come next week and build something around these people I mean you can even do some exercises in the park with them but you're retargeting them I and mean, you're asking them to come back Come back and come back. And the more of a community you build like this, the more popularity you have. For sure, eventually, just do it for free. All your life. For sure, eventually, you can ask for some money. Here and there. I mean, you can ask for some money. I mean, are you guys able to give me some money this time? I mean, if you ask them for some money, you're just asking. But at least you're honest. I mean, that's it. But if you're trying to win some money over from them on the first sight, well, she may get a no. <coughs> but if you are somebody who really, really is into them, really, then guess what? Well, she, it's more how it is. Well, she, guess what? Well, she, people are afraid to make promotions around themselves. If you make a promotion around yourself, promotion, people come. And they come for free. And they come for free because they have nothing to do at home. So they want to, I mean, they want to watch you. And they want to watch something about you. I mean, they're saying so. Go and just enjoy. And make it affordable for everybody. I mean, make it affordable. I mean, make it for free. I mean, for free is the best kind of ideal, but in the for freedom, you, I mean, you win status. I mean, 
An advertisement over there for free and boring means I wouldn't stand at somebody for free. Rosh, if you just go and promote yourself for free and you do everything for free, Rosh, you'll find the free road. I mean, you'll find the free road and you'll become free in some aspect of your life and you shall be set free. And eventually, you'll find that road and you can now travel the world for free as well, doing what you love to do. Because you're willing to do it for free and never for money. I mean, that's end. I understand that. So what I do now is I'm learning, yeah? I'm learning. Do it for free. And yes, 2,000 bucks. I understand you gave 100 hours of your life to have a promotion for yourself. I understand that. But you have to do it. You have to have a promotion for yourself, yeah? Then go and have your own promotion, but try to do it for free. Without having to give money for it. I mean, try to have a free promotion. I can go to busking performances and do it for free. I mean, isn't that better for me? For a year? For a that's much better for me. But if I want to target a place specifically, then guess what? For that's different. For if I want to target boring, then that's different. Which that's different than targeting. And yes, it's for free. And then they never give me money either. I promise you, yeah. But if I go and bask in performances for free, all my life, in front of people, I promise you, there you go. I mean, it's totally for free, isn't it? I promise you, just put one of your portraits there. And this is you, man. And there you go. I mean, that's all. I mean, you'll find the freeway. The freeway is that way. And just enjoy yourself. And that's it. I mean, now all that money extra that you have goes into extra promotions of whatever you, whatever you want to promote yourself other than busking performances. Because that's extra. Or it could be extra for living or traveling somewhere to do a busking performance over there somewhere. I mean, then. Or should just be much more a thinker in terms of how I think about life. I mean, you, I mean, use the word I feel life, so you do the. So, this is about to just send it all over here. But I'm just tying up my shoelaces. I want, I want you guys to see very quickly the now, since I'm understanding what I can do, is the freeway. But is it a scam for you to promote yourself? And to put money in yourself to promote yourself, Rosh, you know. Rosh, you now, guess what, Rosh, if you want to make money, to make money through the free road, then go the free road. And go the free road as much as you can, because people are unable to afford you. And people never understand who you are. I mean, they never understand who you are, but yes, give them a business card for free. I mean, give them something for free. I mean, give them more freedom for free. I mean, if you can make freedom for people, then you also have to understand that they give you money for the freedom you give them. So how can you elaborate for yourself and other people to show them that you're giving them freedom? First, the best thing you can do is give them something for free. First, that's it. First, that's all you can do. First, if someone down the line, they want to help you. Or they never want to help you somewhere down the line. Or if they never want to help you, then they never want to help themselves either. That's it. <coughs> All right, now, busking performances is the best way forward now, always. And it always will be. But you can ask for donations, and you can ask for donations. But donations is come for free. I mean, I'm always asking for donations. I never have to be the guy or woman who has a guitar on the floor asking for donations like that. I never have to be one of those people. I mean, if you want to give me some money for free, then give it to me. Or should I receive it straight away? I mean, in a sense, so that's the thing. <sighs> for sure, now I'm understanding what I'm doing much greater. And if you want to go around doing paid promotion, 
of asking people to come to a certain location or giving more business cards for yourself. Obviously, you can do that if you want. But target new audiences. And what happens is, they suddenly want to come and see this for free. Obviously, most of them are doing nothing. Obviously, most of them are doing nothing on that day. When you call them. Obviously, when you call them for free, they're doing nothing. Obviously, most of them are doing nothing. Obviously, 99% of them are doing nothing. So, make sure you understand that if you call them on a day where it's a work day, obviously, now, guess what? Obviously, most of the time, they are doing something. And if you call them on a Sunday, obviously, they're doing nothing on this day. Most of the time. Obviously, on a Saturday, they're doing nothing most of the time. Obviously, on a Friday, obviously, they're doing something regardless of what you're doing. Obviously, if you're calling other people to your events, and call them on a Saturday or Sunday, for free, on that night, or day. Obviously, yeah. Obviously, if you want to make money, then make money doing it for free. Obviously, if you want to go to nightclubs, then go to the nightclub on that night, and ask the manager on your own time. But give them an album. I mean, give them a promotional album of yours to get the gig for free. I mean, yes, and that's even better. Or give them a business card. I mean, give them a business card to listen to your music on Spotify. Or whatever it is. And that's another fashion. But if you can give them your actual business card and also give them your promotional album or music album to perform at their nightclub sometime for free, then try to do that. But also try to mix in with other people to make an event. Because when you mix in with other people to make an event, you now become somebody on that night as well. You understand? So I, I just recently seen Carl Cox and other people and the only one I recognize is Carl Cox. But other people there are trying to make their names as well. And there's competition. There's a big competition happening. So what do I do? I have to go on the night of enjoying myself with these big events. By promoting myself at these events for free on regular nights. On regular nights, yeah. I have to be a regular DJ there. And what kind of regular DJ? I have to promote their music. I have to promote their music that they want me to promote. Roshi, that's how you win gigs. But is it possible to play my own gigs? Roshi, guess what? Roshi, it is possible. Roshi, I have to ask for it. But the best way to ask is go into the nightclub and ask. Personally. Because I've been trying to get to these people. In terms of nightclubs. But they're unavailable. To talk to them. But if I call them over the phone, they have to be available. But guess what? I probably have to go to a side casino and have to talk to somebody. And guess what? I probably it's more how it is. I'm probably sure that for now, I'll move on. Yeah. Probably now, how do they go around the world? For, I mean, they go for free. And they go for free. I mean, they give money for it. I mean, at first, they had a hard time at first to go around the world for free but then somehow they get more popular very quickly I mean, which gets more popular very quickly throughout the days and why is that? I'm probably sure because there's music that people love or there's music that people want to hear I don't know why or that's why I'm, I'm always speaking about Vici I.O. as well I.O. has music that people want to hear so she has that techno vibe that people want. I have that music that people want to hear, but now I have to be in the nightclubs performing it. So I have to do that for free. I have to do it for free. I mean, you understand? So that's the thing. So every single day, I'm learning. I'm learning something for nothing. But anyway, I understand that my Netflix time is coming up. I'll do some Netflix now so I can go and enjoy myself and. Make sure you guys are enjoying yourselves as well. So, for, for, I mean, for now, I understand what I need to do much greater than yesterday, and that's the whole point.
See, because I do my word, I.